Hello guys, this is Deathproof and in today's video I'm gonna play with uh, my new toy and by toy I mean my new character, my new tier 3 Venom it's the tier 3 I took from the tier 3 selector and I already have run through and built him a bit I'm already capped on attack speed, critical rate, uh, ignore defense and cooldown and I'm missing like 1% of uh, Critical damage, I've got the two rus. it's like mostly 5 star Uru and 4 star Uru's and some 6 star physical attack. My skills, are, all skills are level 6 and okay that doesn't matter and I've got like stage 11 overdrive and I have on him as, how it's called, extreme mobilisk, yes, custom gear with critical rate and 140 proc. Uh, my year, my year. I say, what uh, wrong with my mouth? My uniform is mythic, and all of the stats are mythic also, as you can see. And I'm running low, like uh, seven, like uh, forty-three thousand physical attack, but. I'm gonna try him a bit in the world boss ultimate and world boss legend without the GTP and uh, CTP of. Uh, Raid at the moment and let's see him doing damage into Proxima and the what I'm gonna use it's like uh, I can use Null for his leadership I guess it's the best leadership in the game for him and let's go for some uh, extra yes that's an extra at 5% uh, movement and attack speed and I'm getting the passive ability uh, here also 50% against the uh, villains and 30% ignore dodge and 60% all attack so I'm pretty good buff there and the best strikers of course 3 12% hex and mind control by summer Rat Rachel summer the daughter of Dean I guess and let's see him doing some damage here and I guess the proc is uh, cancelling the 5th skill into the 4th skill because the 4th skill is doing the most out of the damage and I'm not seeing any proc at the moment but I guess I'm doing something wrong and let's see here you want to proc in the 6th skill I'm not sure if I'm gonna proc on it but I'm gonna try at least and you can cancel the 6th skill after you see the dinosaur popping up I guess uh, of course that's why character is better with the CTP of Raid because you don't want to waste your proc waiting into the 6 skill as you can see the 6 skill got a bit uh, huge animation it's very nice don't get me wrong but uh, it's kind of huge to use a proc on it you want the CTP of Raid to take uh, advantage of more hits and not just the one and big hit there I've seen a lot of people playing with uh, Venom with a CTP of uh, energy also because you can take advantage of the passive ability he got when you get heal you're getting 10% uh, chain hit damage so you can manage to proc perfect with a CTP of energy and take advantage of this 10% more chain hit and I want to heal somehow here and yes there is some healing there and here and there and the fourth skill it's good for that reason and I want to do proc yes that's a proper proc I think and I want to try to heal a bit yes I did some healing that's a good part of uh, playing with Venom I mean he is official the best striker to have for heal so I guess playing as, as, uh, as him it's uh, even better and you oh, I waste my tier 3 here I guess cause uh, Proxima gonna move into the next phase, yes, I lost some damage there, I, it took the, some damage from the tier 3 at the start, but uh, at the ending, the biting, I think I miss a lot of it, and let's try to avoid the spears here also, I can't take so, oh, that was one hit KO, yes, that was one hit KO, but you can see there, I have 5 bars left, and I spent it already like two minutes with bad rotations and uh, moving around a lot with him. So it's 
it's kind of nice even with the proc you can do it real easy and I've got like uh, eight percent pierce so it's not that my cards are driving the character there is uh, a lot of counts with more peers there and you can see I'm not even 100% physical attack in total with the all attack it's like something less than this so that's why I'm pretty much struggling against the uh, stage 99 prox mark with just a proc but uh, we can fix it let's try again now with Venom where is Venom where is my boy here you are against uh, Valkyr as a striker and let's try to bring also, yes, unseen one, to save ourselves from the tentacles, I guess, of the octopus is there, the black one, the slime octopus, I guess. And let's go to try to fix our rotation, and let's try, no, not that character, ah, I forgot. Let's try to proc on the fifth skill, and after that cancelling into the three, filling our tier 3 with pressing all the skills, yes the 5th skill seems the more legit to proc on and I'm gonna try to proc on the 6th skill there and I did, I, I cancelled it too early, I'm not sure but it was like uh, there's no damage there, I am not sure what happened perhaps I lost the proc totally, I'm not sure, let's see here another proc and let's see the bite first and after start cancel yes i cancelled the third the sixth skill before guys yes it's official it was my bad there mm, let's try to stay out of the clinder cage here by pressing some skills and uh, make ourselves on an iframe let's go to the sixth skill again and wait until we see the bite yes there is a bite there of course I lost totally the proc there, I proc'd on the second skill, perhaps it's the worst skill to proc on, yes, I did it. And let's try to proc on the fifth skill, mm, kind of bad damage, I think I have to proc on the fourth skill I guess, let's try to proc on the sixth skill here, yes, that's a nice proc there, and it's pretty nice, of course, three minutes left, three minutes and a half, seems like I can clear it, but... Uh, I'm struggling here, I'm struggling and let's see if we can take out a good proc on the 6 skill here yes, that's a good proc on the 6 skill I guess that's how it looks at least and of course we did it once but uh, we can manage to do it more than once and let's try to see if we can avoid all the biomarial biom how it's called, all the, you see, the slimes and all the hazards of the stage and let's try to do the six skill uh, I need more time for it I guess so I need to run here yes 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 run 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 yes I saved myself I think I can get some slimes in my face and stay alive there so that's pretty good for me and let's try to take the slimes and proc again on the 6 skill, yes, that's a proc on the 6 skill, I guess, and that's pretty nice. Yes, that's nice damage, guys. 3 or 4 bars worth of damage was there, and let's try to make some slimes. Oh, I need to swap. Yes, at least I lost now there, and I didn't lost Venom. So I'm gonna skip hitting here, just to see only Venom doing the... Let's see, the 5th skill proccing there, nice and fourth skill jumping around oh I need to run here also yes slimes are coming he's run nice his movement speed uh, movement speed is decent and let's try to proc on the sixth skill oh he's jumping there but of course we are ignoring the iframe nice that's a good part of the sixth skill I guess Perhaps it's taking too long, but uh, when it starts happening, you can't miss it. You can't miss from iframe ignoring or something. No one can hide after the bite of venom. I'm not gonna waste it here, I guess. I need more time than uh, now thinking here, so I'm gonna skip. Yes. I did skip it and let's try to avoid the goose here also by swapping the character you know the trick I guess you are not learning it from me 
and let's go to swap into Venom and try to cast his 6 skill first and try to yes do the 4 skill here to have some slimes and run and yes we build up some slimes to have for this phase here because we, we're gonna get hit by him and let's try the third skill and I took a lot of damage there I want to skip the tier 3 and do it uh, when he's gonna do this thing yes let's go to see if we're gonna take any damage with the tier 3 of Venom during this phase generally you're taking a lot of damage but as you can see you can avoid it with the tier 3 skill and of course you're gonna die if you're not gonna run after us <laughs> but I did some damage there I lost the proc but uh, it's nice it's nice doing uh, all this testing with you and let's see if we need to gather some slimes here yes we need we totally need to do it we have no time here no no way to do that yes two bars left of course we could clear it if i wasn't so bad on rotation of venom i guess in mephisto i'm gonna take my luck back but you see there you in the previous video i did like same obelisk with mephisto and because he's a native tier 3 and no uh, 800 tier 3 he managed to clear with two minutes left so you can see here the big difference of native tier 3 and symbol 100 ccf 800 ccf tier 3 characters the normal ones let's go with the same team here and where is the team i guess venom it's in the end no no where are you venom yes you're here and let's take uh, our girl here mystique goes mystique go to ctp of insight and perhaps we need some more pushing here to clear the stage as we saw in the last try I didn't manage to kill the boss for 2% but uh, pff, it's pretty good I did a good try there with just a 140 obelisk 120 or something like this I don't really remember and let's see if we can clear it Mephisto we got the disadvantage of uh, typing here but uh, it's nice trying at least without a CDP I'm gonna get. I'm guessing when I'm gonna get a CTP of uh, rage on him for the ABX Combat Hero Day. He's gonna sign in the World Boss Legend also because uh, all these skills doing decent damage, but you don't want to proc on one skill specific. You want to do to have more damage in general. So I guess CTP of rage is gonna help more. And here because I'm doing bad. Uh, uh, I'm doing bad management of my skills. I managed to enrage him so fast. And let's try to proc on the 6 skill here. The bad thing is that we can't see if we're doing it right or we're doing something wrong. And we wanted to change the rotation. And I'm not really sure at the moment. But I guess doing every skill and letting only the 5th skill and the 6th skill playing works until now yes that's good proc i did it on the six skill i guess and here you want to stay in the middle of this ability and again another enrage oh my god i have no damage to clear the stage i guess guys i went with my bad rotation here and Yes, after the 5th skill, I've seen a lot of people using the 3rd skill, because it's kind of nice to damage. I'm gonna take the risk and use the tier 3 again. I knew I was close about uh, to change the face, but I, I don't want it to risk it for and waiting there without uh, doing nothing. So let's see if we can take the slimes here and eat something to fill our health bar. And let's try to do... Oh, we need to switch here or we're gonna die through the fire and let's try to avoid the boss with Mystic. Yes, we did it. And let's try to swap into... Oh my god, I'm gonna use the tier 3. Oh my god, I couldn't stay alive inside this thing. <laughs> I guess you can clear Mephisto with Venom with better rotation but uh, not with my build and my Conqueror level. I mean... 
of course you could try but uh, I was having hard time of course I could go away from the fires there but uh, I can't I don't feel like uh, he's a character that you have to play him with a CTP with a obelisk and the proc on it you need the CTP of raids because there is a lot of hits in all of your skills and you don't want to spend only the proc for only one spell and the sixth skill it's the best to do it but it's kind of hard to timing perfect the proc just to hit on the bite exactly moment so for me it's a CTP of rage character and I'm gonna swap it in the future I just want to play with my new toy without uh, giving him a CTP of rage and 50 nerd stones of chaos nice there Thank you for being here, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more, like the video if you like and I hope I help you decide uh, if you want to build him or not. He's very good for uh, ABX and I'm gonna showcase him with a CDP of raids in ABX also for sure in the future. Bye bye to everyone, thank you for being here guys, see you in the next.